the reason why these curses are being attracted it is because of what you call violation of the covenant now the issue is Adam has violated the covenant through disobedience now whenever you break the covenant whether you like it or not it comes with a consequence some of you could be free from curses yes but you are walking under the side effects of the covenants you broke because the mistakes most people do after they broke the covenant and they almost experienced the punishment they repented and they got forgiven they forget also to make a sacrifice that they are healed from the side effects of the broken covenants now through Noah God has already achieved the first plan Mungu amefanikiwa mpango wa kwanza of wiping out the face of the earth with water ya kuharibu vyote na garika but the very day Noah opened the ark lakini ile siku Noah alifungua safina he comes out anatoka nje and the curse in the system la laana ambayo ilikuwa kwa mtindo huo in its appointed time kwa wakati timlifu lands again in the house of Noah ikanguka tena kwa nyumba ya Noah through what we call kupitia kile ambacho tunachokiita drunkardness ulevi huyu jamaa ametoka tu kwa safina saa hii na anakunywa pombe now through drunkardness kupitia kwa ulevi the covenant is violated hiyo agano tena imefunjwa now he is forced to curse him for having seen him naked kwa kumuona akiwa uji some of we pastors and fathers we expose ourselves watoto wakisha tuona tunaanza tukutembea tukisema wacheni kuona baba yenu akiwa uchi mtalaaniwa you are an irresponsible father for well, having exposed your nakedness wewe ni baba usiyewajibika kama baba jiite mkutano kwanza jiulize kabla ni laani huyu mtoto ni wapi nimekosea ah come on fathers of this house also we have to come to a place when we have to stop being stupid Umeona tu katoa suruali yako ukasimama mbele uchi hivi watoto wakuone tena uanze kulaani laani watoto kwa nini umeniona nikiwa uchi excuse me jaribu laani mimi uone watoto wako ndo watakufuranga mikuu akitoka shule akishika mimba za mapema wakitoka ngoja laani wiki lifuone mzaa anarudi nyumbani amelewa amechikojolea mate imepita imeteremka kamasi imepita imeteremka amejipupulia na mtoto wake ndio huyu anarudi kutoka shuleni na akona na wenzake marafiki zake do you expect your son to be proud of you na nyinyi wazazi japokuwa ni vyema watoto kuwaheshimu ili ya kwamba wapate heri na waishi miaka mirefu kuweni waangalifu ipasavyo kuhakikisha kwamba msiwakorofishe watoto wenu i'm really sorry that some of your children they are not proud of you vile unatokanga na suruali unaandika kwa mlango ya plot hivi na mtoto wako anaona siku zetu hata suruali ya mama haungeiona sokoni kamisi ya mama haungeiona sokoni unaamka tu napata mama mkamba very beautiful woman amekuweka suruali iko kwa mlango hivi and you must not talk na kumbuka kuna siku nyingine nilingoja zikakauka za jirani mwingine suruali sita na kamisi moja na kanjiri wakati zilikauka nikachukua nikaenda nikanua kerosene nikazimwagilia nikachoma nikamwambia nipeleke kwa chief nimechoma suruali na zingine asijafuliwa vizuri na mama mnajua wakati hujafua suruali kama ni chafu vile inakaa sasa mtoto wako anaona suruali yako iko na stains then you expect that that child will be reasonable huyo mtoto hata hawai kuheshimu wange ni kuambia ukweli kama utaka kusikia hii somo unisikize tu vizuri some of you your children are not proud of you and that's why they don't even desire that they get blessed of you wewe baba unajua tu vizuri uko na watoto kwa nyumba anda wewe imetoboka hapa imeto iko na indicator iko na indicator iko na alafu hauna aibu unaiacha kwa bafu umeianika kwa kamba ya bafu na unajua kwa hiyo bafu unashaya na nani na mtoto wako the question becomes how do you expect that boy to be proud of you omwana we inzoha ne inzoha atabadilika akue kitu kingine kibaya zaidi kukuliko wewe na una aibu unakuja kumkelelesha kwa sababu umepata akifuta banki kwa nyumba yake amekaa kwa kiti akivuta nini banki 
akikuuliza swali daddy prove to me that i should not do this wewe utamwambia aje unarudingi kwa nyumba umewewa nini sigara unavuta hivi tell me how you will tell that boy it is wrong to smoke wakati unavutanga wakiona fathers let us look at our positions especially sisi wachungaji na wacheni niambia wachungaji mko hapa tafadhali wacheni niambia tu kweli vile tunalea watoto wa watu pia sisi tunaza mwalimu nataka unisikilize vizuri kuja hapa walimu na wachungaji makinika ipasavyo kuna mwalimu alinitanga kwa parade nikishaimba ananipigia makofa anasema mwana wewe imbwa saa hizi he has produced very stupid boys none of his children is successful na yeye mwenyewe pombe imempeleka kwa kaburi angalau angeni appreciate na saa hizo nimekula na tinyende mtu wa Mungu haujui kesho ya huyo mtu kesho ya huyo mtu iko kwa mikono ya Mungu walimu na wachungaji tumakinike kamtiana kamutu ndio kameshika mimba makosa yamepatikana how do you solve that problem every day huyo mtoto anakuwa ndio topic kwa madhabahu mmemsukuma amekuja ametubu ndio lakini psychologically kuna vita vinaendelea vita vya guilt vita vya aibu kwa sababu mama mchungaji akisimama anatumiwa kama example mchungaji akisimama huyo mtoto bado anatumiwa kama example wako mwenyewe ameshika mimba ukachukua ukaenda kuficha kwa anti yako azalie huko ukakuja kudanganya kanisa kwa hii madhabahu ya kwamba ameenda boarding school atarudi akifunga atarudi mtoto akitembea goja tunaza leeni watoto wa watu vizuri wazazi tumakinike na angaliange eric komondi na muhurumia sana na hizo vitu anafanya na wasichana wa watu and in public Ngoja watoto wake wa gro wafike pahali number one, when they see what Eric Omondi is doing they will never be proud of their father that's why watoto wa baadhi ya hawa celebs number one, they don't want to come in public waonekane because they are not proud of their parents hiyo program Eric Omondi ana run hiyo inaitwa wife material it is a wicked program that no father no mother would want to see it demonstrated on his or her child Eric Komondi asha panda mbegu ambayo lazima watoto wake watakuja kufanya magani kuvuna vile unatumia watoto wa wenzako wako watafanya magani watakuja kutumiwa na watakapotumiwa watatumiwa vibaya zaidi ya jinsi ulivyo tumia wa wenzako kwa sababu mtu unapopanda mbegu unavunanga mbegu pamoja na mkate wake Nimeona ingine kwa social media. Ngombe ingine imeajiriwa kama house guard. Na haijui mwenye hiyo nyumba amechukua ya CCTV, ameweka kwa saa. Hiyo saa wewe unaona tu ina account ikienda hivi. Kumbe kuna ka CCTV kako hapo kana record everything in the sitting room. Anasukuma mtoto wa mtu akifanya hivi, anamkanyaga tege kwa kifua. Unarudi nyumbani kama mtoto kama akana adjectives za kutosha kueleza kile kamepitia. Let me tell you that's why you can never be married hata upate wanaume wangapi wanakupenda mpaka wapi ukweli ni kwamba bingu hazitaruhusu na ukaoleka utatoka kwa hiyo ndoa kwa sababu ya vile umelea mtoto wa wenyewe ile pesa unalipwa na huyo bozi wako baada kutumia mtoto wake vibaya kumkanyaga kwa kifua kumchapa makofi ukweli ni kwamba unapoikula unaikula kama laana na that's una kasichana kadogo kama an hapa atika kwa na ulcers atika kwa na pressure kako na heart issues moyo umeanza kufura sijui nini imeanza unashindwa ana haya yametoka wapi wakati mwingine ni vizuri unajiita mkutano ujiulize mwenyewe katika kio je ni nini ambacho naweza kuwa nimefanyia wenzangu ama mtu yeyote katika haya maisha ambacho huenda kimevutia aina hii ya laana juu ya maisha yangu tafadhali lea mtoto wenyewe vizuri wako atalelewa bwana asifiwe this is the first parent to curse his son huyu ni mzazi wa kwanza kumlaani mwanawe but in the process of cursing lakini hiyo mtindo the bible says that curse 
God never allowed it to land on Ham. Because Ham had been blessed of God. If there is anything I wish you desired this day, it is that you get blessed of God. Because the blessings of the Lord they make rich and they come with no sorrows. Sometimes you may want your father to bless you that he may have died long ago. Sometimes you might want her to bless you and she may not be willing but if you pray that God blesses you whether your parent blessed you or not you will still prosper in this life. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Now look here. When you are blessed by God hata waze waluya wangapi wakae vikao vingapi Walaani la anangapi wakikula msaya ngombe sijui na manyama gani it will never touch haiwezi kuogoza jaribu angalie maboma ya wale watu ambao wanatumika kufanya utamaduni atukisikia kwa nani kimetokea kitu wewe ndio uko preserved kubeba madawa za kienyeji ya manyasi wewe ndio uko preserved kubeba sijui nini angalia hizo familia akonanga mtu wa sense anatokea kwa hizo familia because there is a portion you carry you as the priest <laughs> Let me tell you. If I better your life as a preacher. Whether you give me something or not. God shall get my life better. Why? It's because there is a portion you carry as a priest. So if you curse somebody. There is a portion you carry. You are ruining your own house.